that is a good question and I don't know why I haven't made a video on this before maybe because these units are so new and you just haven't I haven't gone through you know too many carburetors on these but uh, I'm going to show how I do it it may not be per the book but check this out. And by the way, if you haven't gone over to Chicanic's uh, YouTube channel, you need to go over there and subscribe to her channel. She is one good mechanic. Her question is, is how do you remove the carburetor? Because it feels like it's gonna break something whenever you try to pull this off. And you, you would think that you could just unhinge it right here, but it won't. I've actually broken a couple of these cam buckles. The first couple of ones that I did, but this is how I do it, and let me show you. What I do is I get one of these little uh, steel screwdrivers, and I, ma I manipulate the throttle to where I can catch it right here with my finger, like that, and then get your screwdriver in behind and twist, and it'll come right out when you can remove the carburetor. Disconnect your fuel lines, of course. Getting the throttle linkage back in is pretty straightforward. It'll kind of halfway line up for you. Just set the crook of that in there and then take your screwdriver. like that <laughs> it's a cantankerous little cuss I mean, you gotta have a little bit of patience if you're gonna work on small engines you gotta have patience but anyway guys if this little tutorial helped you out please give me a thumbs up and smash that subscribe button and let me know in the comments if this helped you out and uh, be sure like I said to go check out Ch uh, Chicanic's uh, YouTube channel. Y'all have a good rest of your day and we'll catch you on the next one.